We've just watched Irish swimming history. Mona McSherry has just swam in an Olympic final. An Olympic final. Let that just sink in. It, it's absolutely incredible. The 20-year-old from the Grange in Sligo, who represented Ballyshannon Marlins, coached by Grace Reed, and has just recently moved to Tennessee to swim in the collegiate system over there, just swam in a 100 breaststroke final at the Olympic Games. It's phenomenal, and I'm so proud of her, and I know the country is so proud of her. In terms of the actual race herself, the first thing I noticed is she had a huge smile across her face walking out again. She was just taking in the moment, taking in the atmosphere, taking in everything. And it's amazing. All of these experiences are going to stand to Mona as she moves forward in her career. Because let's be clear, this is only a step in Mona's journey. She has so much potential and so much uh, ahead of her. It's so exciting to watch. In terms of the actual race, Mona, she swam 66.9, another sub-67 swim, which is a really, really strong swimming. Her dive was probably the best dive she's done across the three rounds. Uh, she turned at 50 and 31.6, she, which was the same time she turned in the 50, at the 50 in the semi-final. But she had maybe taken one or, she had taken one or two extra strokes to get to that 31.6 in the final compared to the semi-final. And I think that expenditure of energy maybe caught up to her a little bit on the second 50 because she wasn't quite as quick coming home. She had a bit of a tough lane draw as Chickenova in the lane beside her came back really, really strong. She had the second fastest second 50 apart from Lydia Jacobi, the American 17-year-old who ended up winning the race. So it was a tough draw for Mona, but it's a phenomenal achievement to swim in an Olympic final, to come eighth in the Olympic Games, the biggest stage of the all, Mona has done phenomenally well. I know there's going to be swimmers all around the country up in the middle of the night watching her and hopefully we're going to see them make Olympic finals in the future. Mona was only the second Irish person to swim an Olympic final, the first in 25 years and she's going to inspire a generation to hopefully do the same and Mona won't realise the impact she's had on others yet but she will in years to come. I think Mona's the only other, the only Irish swimmer to swim 100 breaststroke sub 67 the only female swimmer to done that and she's done that a total of eight times this year that consistency is amazing and she's done it under the biggest pressure she did it first of all to qualify for the olympic games at trials in april then she did it three more times to progress through the rounds at europeans and she's just done it another three times at the olympic games to go from heat to semi to final that consistency is phenomenal and it just shows to me that there's so much more there for Mona in the future moving forward. She's a phenomenal athlete, she's a really great person and she's so dedicated and hard working that there's only big things to come from her in the future. Next year she does Europeans and Worlds, next year is an exciting year and then we're not that far away from Paris so the future is so bright for Mona and she has done the whole country proud uh, there's people awake all over the country who have just watched her. So it's an amazing achievement. Brilliant for Irish swimming. Brilliant for Mona. She also has the 200 breaststroke coming up on Wednesday, which I can't wait to watch. I think she's going to have a great 200 as well. Uh, so it, it's just a phenomenal, phenomenal night of swimming for Irish swimming. Apart from Mona, there were some really exciting races in the pool as well. Uh, highlights for me were we had two back-to-back 1-2s. First by the British... British boys in the men's 200 freestyle where Tom Dean won with Duncan Scott in second by 0 0.02 and that was such an exciting race with different tactics across the pool and a few minutes after that we had the men's 100 back row where the Russians did their own double with Ryloff in lane 2 I think uh, getting the touch by 0 0.02 again over Klim Kaleshnikov in that 100 back row so it was really really exciting evening of swimming or night of swimming because it's 3 in the morning 4 in the morning um, but it's just brilliant and Mona is the star of the show from an Irish point of view and I can't wait to watch what she's going to do in the rest of the week 